everyone today's unboxing video is a a subscription box related video it is um, not directly a subscription service um, this is the second one um, I did one previously for Annie's fiction which is a um, hardcover clean reads subscription service um, and I had purchased the Secrets of Castleton Manor series, some of their books in in that video and talked about that. So um, this one I'm doing a different series. Um, Annie's Fiction has where you can, they've got several, several services. There's like 10 of them, I think. Um, they've got Cozy Mysteries, Amish Fiction, Women's Fiction, and the newest one's like a Romantic Suspense. Um, you basically pay $1.99 plus $4.95 for shipping for the first book and then $14.99 plus $5.95 shipping for, um, or $4.95 shipping, anyway, five books, um, for shipping, uh, for, uh, every book that you get after that. I love subscription services and I am always looking for subscription services where I've got clean reads. But the price tag of $20 a book, even though it's a hardcover, uh, that was just a little bit too much for me to do. I just couldn't justify that because I, I'm a reader. I like my books. And, um, you know, for 20 bucks, I can get, you know, four plus books somewhere else rather than just one. So, um, and that's what I did. I went to eBay. You can also purchase things off of Amazon. Um, there's other like half price books. You can go to their online store to, to buy basically their used books most of the time. Um, I will say that you can get the new ones. You can even get the new ones rather than paying 20 bucks for the subscription service for a new one. You can actually get the same book new for cheaper um, on these other websites. So. Uh, what I did was I did bargain shopping, so that's what I'm going to show you in this. I went on to eBay. I pulled up the series that I wanted. Checked out all kinds of listings. For the series. And this was the one that I ended up with. So I was doing my comparison shopping. Um, I will say that when you're buying from private sellers, you kind of take a chance. Not everything is going to be in, um, overall, I have good experiences with eBay sellers overall. Um, but there are the odd ones where you don't have the greatest experience. I did get, if you look at my last video on the secrets of Castleton Manor, I did get a couple of books from one seller that they smelled musty. I have not tried to get the musty smell out of them. It's a lighter musty smell, so maybe, but I don't have too much luck in that respect. So, so we'll see. But having said all that to say, you know, you take your chances. So the, uh, this series from Annie's Fiction is, uh, and you can see here, Annie's Fiction. And you can see that it's used because I've got some scuffing on the cover here. And also it went through on the book. Um, this is, oh, actually, this is an extra one. <laughs> uh, this is Annie Secrets of the Quilt. It's one of their series. This was not the series I was looking for. This was an extra book in this lot. So I was like, oh, cool, get an extra book. It looked interesting. This was not why I bought this particular box. So here, actually, let me put this over here. Okay. Um, so in no particular order, this is the series. It, this is the inn. I don't know if you can see it because it's very small. The inn at Magnolia Harbor. And this is women's fiction. Um, each book is done by a different author. Some authors repeat, like, um, this is Deanna Julie Dodson. And she also wrote for this series. And I think she writes a few more in this, this series here. And, um, there are hardcover books. See, hardcover. They have these little cloth bookmarks, which is nice. And I can tell by the way that it opens that, you know, this is a used book. 
but this is in decent shape. Okay, so let me put that one there. Okay, and then I have Safe Harbor. This is by Elizabeth Penny, and this is the first book in the series. I know because that's the one I started. I, I typed that book in first on my search looking for the books. Um, this one uh, at Summer's End. I don't know where that falls in the series. Okay, and then I have Where Hope Blooms. I think that one might actually be the second one, but I'm not sure. And then the last one in the box, Finding Vows. Oh, look, cute little bookmark. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to put that one over here. All right. So I bought this lot for these five books in the in um, at, at Magnolia Harbor series. This is the first five books in the series, starting with this one. If I had purchased them off of the subscription service from Annie's Fiction, I would have paid um, $1.99 plus $4.95 shipping, so, you know, seven bucks for this book, and then 20 40 60 80 so $87 for these four books and that doesn't include this one sitting over here um i paid 21 dollars and 37 cents for all of these books 21 dollars and 37 cents <laughs> that included my shipping that included my tax so you see what i mean for one book from annie's fiction brand new i managed to get the first five books in the series plus an extra one so all that to say, you know, you shop around. If you want brand new book and you want consistent, you know, every month I get this brand new book, I'm good with that, then, you know, I'm not knocking it if you're gonna, if you wanna pay $20 for a book, really, I'm not. Uh, I just love that you wanna read, right? Um, Re-readers, we have to stick together. <laughs> uh, but if you um, wanna pay less, then it's, it's always nice to go looking on the places like eBay and Amazon and seeing what deals you can find. These are gent these are used. I can tell, like I said, I could tell. Um, there's a little scuffing on them. Oh, one important thing I'm gonna do is no smell. Awesome. Um, I don't have usually have too many problems with the smells on the books, but you take your chances. Sometimes they get that way. Um, if I can, I will tell tell people that I don't want books from smokers homes because you absolutely cannot get smoking the, the smoke out of books. I've tried it. Uh, they're almost gone at that point. I don't even bother getting books that I, I toss them or donate them because they're just no good at that point. So anyhow, I'm rambling uh, just so that you, this is my like public service announcement. I love that Annie's Fiction has this subscription service, and I think this could be a great thing for people. But I'm also telling you, you can get the same books, gently read, for less money, and um, this is the way I've done it. So um, that's it for today's video. I hope you like this video. Please take a moment to hit the like button below if you have. I will leave a link down below to my website, which will give you a more formal review and some pictures. And um, also I'll leave a link down below to Annie's Fiction. If you, you know, would like to check them out, you know, certainly go ahead and do that. You actually can get the first book of the subscription service for $7. And um, you could cancel after that, I think. I don't, there's no commitment that I know of. I couldn't find anything that said you had to have a commitment. So um, yeah, that's it for today's video. Thanks so much for stopping by and watching. You guys are awesome. Have a great day.